Hi everybody, it's Crystal. Hopefully your favorite yarn junkie. Um, if not, hopefully I, I can grow on you and be your favorite. <laughs> Anyways, I hope everybody is doing well and I hope everybody is staying safe as always. Um, so today I have a yarn unboxing from Mary Maxim. I always say their name wrong. I usually say Mary Maximum, which I'll probably say a lot, but that's okay. I pronounce things wrong all the time. Anyways, I honestly do not remember what's in this box because it's been like three weeks ago that I ordered it because I do know there's a mystery box in it and they were on back order. So it took, I had to wait for them to come in stock again. So I just now, I got it a, a couple days, a few days ago. And I don't remember what's in it. So it's going to be, besides, other than the mystery box, it's going to be a surprise for us both. Now remember, if you're not subscribed to my channel, I greatly appreciate it. I have lots of uh, yarn content, reviews, um, unboxings. T try to tell you about new yarns, new yarn companies. Um, Lots of crochet tutorials, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds, anything that you could want. I have it. Almost. And yes, I do have an empty shelf behind me. I know that you guys probably noticed that. And no, I will not tell you what's going to go on that shelf. It's a secret. If I told you, it would ruin the surprise. But that's a special shelf. And I'm going to keep it bare for now. So. Let's go ahead and move on and open up this box of yarn. Do you want to from Mary Maxim? Ma Maxim. I said it right. I said it right. So I haven't opened it. I'm going to open it now. Um, if you're not familiar with Mary Maxim, um, I've never had a problem with them. They usually ship relatively uh, quick, but this time I knew that it was, I didn't know when it was going to be because it did, they did tell me that the mystery boxes were on back order. And usually they have pretty good mystery boxes. Um, they used to have the best I've, that I've seen, but lately I've had one better, which I do have a video on that also, and some of them to open up eventually when I get around to it. So this is a big box of, or a big box of whatever in here, <laughs> yarn. Some of it was new um, to their site. Tissue paper. I don't care about that. Okay. Oh, they had a really, they had some good deals on some yarn. It feels like there's something in my hair, but it's no, there's not. There's nothing in it. It's just the lighting it's hitting it just right, making it look like there's something in it. But no, it's there's nothing in it. Okay. So I know they had some yarn that was. A really good deal so I bought it so I'm gonna show you that right quick um, first 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 things first let me find my my invoice and that way I can tell you what I paid what is all this stuff here oh they gave me something I didn't buy this they gave me sparkle stickers uh, like the, the little dot kits that you do these are for my for my little kids will like doing them. Oh my son will love that shark. Certainly he'd love sharks. That's so cute. We have included a free sample of our diamond dots in your order. Well thank you, Mary Maxim Maxim. And then they send you I don't know. Other flyers and whatnot. Okay. Here is my order form so I can tell you what I paid for this stuff. Okay, now this is not new, but it was a killer deal, and I can't pass up a killer deal. Bag of Day doesn't pass up killer deals. This is something that I don't do. Even though I don't need the yarn, eventually I'll give it away in a giveaway. So I don't pass up give, kill, killer deals. This one, that color though, is really pretty. I might use this. I like oranges and yellows and browns and rusty colors and and whatnot. So anyways, maybe you have seen this, maybe you haven't. Now this is called a Lion Brand's Touch of Mohair. It's a very, a very soft yarn. And I have had this before. Um, I'll go ahead and read about it. Um, so the Lion Brand Touch of Mohair, you can kind of see how it's fuzzy there. 
It says one ball will make a shawl, or one ball will make a scarf, two balls will make a shawl, and four balls will make a sweater. Well, let's read and see if I concur with that. So there's 3.5 ounces, 100 grams, 339 yards. And it's three, it's a lightweight three, which I agree with it being a lightweight three. Yes, I'm going to concur with their, with their, uh, not a small shawl, a small shawl and probably a smaller sweater. But yes, it'll definitely make a scarf. Anyway, I'm going to move, I'm going to move on. It is machine wash on cool and lay flat to dry. 90% acrylic and there's 10% mohair. It's, uh, made in Turkey. The color I hold in my hand is called a burnt orange. So I just wanted to look something up on their site real quick. So I stopped the camera. So I paid a dollar ninety nine per skein, which is an excellent deal. Now these are regular price seven dollars a ball. So um, at the making of this video, 10, 10, 2020, they're still on clearance for a dollar ninety nine versus the seven ninety nine that you usually pay. Um, I know Lion Brand does have a new uh, mohair yarn out. This could be going out on forever. I'm not certain, but I do know they put a, a new touch of mohair out. Um, so I don't know. Anyway, so $1.99 versus $7. That's a killer deal. So I got that burnt orange, and then I got it in uh, mosaic blue. That's pretty blue. I'm not going to open up the packages, but... Um, Reminds me of like a deep water blue, I guess. I got another orange because the orange was my favorite. Oh, and I got a couple pinks for my baby girl, Rose. She loves pink. This pink would be her style. This one's called Lilac Rose. It's even got her name in it. So I got, I mean, I can't beat a dollar ninety-nine when it used to be seven. I know, I know, I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have, but I did. And then I have a white that I was going to pair probably with that pink. And then I have a purple, which is called uh, Bermuda. No, no, no. Purple Haze. Oh, Purple Haze. I may see. Okay, yeah. Purple Haze. So, yeah, they still have them on sale. I can make this video. It's a good deal. If you guys like good deals, I hit that up. Okay. Now, um, I don't have a lot of yarn in this box because I did buy a mystery box too. So this I have had before. Um, this is their uh, Aspen uh, yarn. Um, the color is called a mountain pink. It's very pretty. Scarfable. Scarfable, if you're new to my channel, means that I would use it to make a scarf and it would not, or anything against your skin, it would not itch you. So, and it is a rowing style yarn, as you can see right there. Now, this is a bulky five, which bulky five is my favorite. A roving is my favorite. So there it, ha there it has, you know, all the things I love about it. Machine washable and dryable on gentle cycle. Um made in turkey approximately 130 yards now these are 3.99 a piece again i it may seem like not a lot 130 yards but 130 yards of a bulky five gets you a lot farther than 130 yards of a four weight so i don't think uh 3.99 for uh 130 yards of a bulky roving style because i'm partial to roving really i am it's don't get much better than that. But anyways, that's just me though. Um, I like it a lot. So I did order one, two, three, four, five, six of them. And like I said, I don't remember what I ordered this stuff for. Obviously, I had intentions for this. I would say probably something for my daughter since it's pink. Usually when I get pink, my intentions are for my daughter. So yeah, but I did order that touch lion brand touch of mohair or whatever because it was on clearance. So, <laughs> uh, but I was probably going to use the yellow and the pink and probably put the rest in giveaways. Okay, let's see what else I got here. Okay. Okay, there's a couple more stuff here than I thought. 
Okay. Oh, I got this. Um, this is more of that Aspen yarn that I just showed you in pink. The color of this one is called Fireside. My intentions were, I remember now, to make myself a hat out of that. And I will, <laughs> I will be doing that, definitely. It's pretty. Really pretty burgundies or in rust and blues and just all the colors that I love. Yes, my hat for me. I like to make myself a lot of hats, but for some reason, you know, I have a pile of hats over here in the corner. But for some reason, I usually only wear this black one. I don't know why. I think I'm going to make this hat. This I have a tutorial for this hat in case you wondered. If you type in Bago de Crochet Chocolate Bonbon Beanie on YouTube, it'll pop up. Um, in the tutorial, I use a different yarn. But this yarn is Loops and Threads Impeccable. I think I'm going to use, make this hat using um, maybe that yarn. But it's a bulky five. I'll have to make do some adjustments. But anyways, enough of that. Okay, so this was new uh, to me. I'd never seen it. I'd never seen it on their site before. This is called Mary Maximum Cloud Spun. Cloud Spun. That just sounded awesome when I read about it. So the Mary Maxim Cloud Spun is six ninety nine. But is it worth six ninety nine? So it's soft, like not like a cloud, but it is soft enough that I would wear a scarf out of it. Definitely, it's a very pretty pinks and grays colors. I like that, very pretty. It's a hundred percent acrylic, super bulky number six. Now I definitely would not classify that as a bulky six. To me, that is a, a thicker five weight yarn. That does not look like a bulky six. How about you guys? That's a bulky five. So, um, yeah, but that's okay. I, again, that's my favorite. I love it. Um, it's not a roving style. It's just a regular plied yarn. Care, instruct care instructions are machine washable and dryable on gentle. Made in Turkey. 218 yards or 200 grams. The color I have in my hands is called a champagne. So, um, $6.99 for 218 yards of a bulky five. It says bulky six. I can guarantee you when you get it, it's not going to be a bulky six. This one might have been a little high priced. Although it is a nice yarn, it is very pretty. Um, this one might end up in a in a giveaway. It, I mean, like I said, it, it'd make a really nice scarf or something. But I do like it. It's very pretty. But I wanted to get it because it was new and I just wanted to show you guys and tell you my thoughts. But $6.99 might, I don't know. Yeah, it's probably a bit much for that. Because if it was a bulky six, probably it would be worth it. But it's not a bulky six. It's, it's a five weight or maybe a, a little bit thicker of a five, but it's definitely not a bulky. Super bulky, I mean. Anyways, I still like it. Okay, then I got one more here, and then we'll open that mystery box. Want to? I've had this before. Never used it. Always gave it away. But I have. I've had had it before. This is the Mary Maxim 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 Marvelous Chunky Chunky Chunky. I'm a chunky yarn lover. So it's a bulky five, and it is a bulky five. Machine wash and dryable on gentle. Made in Turkey, approximately 270 yards of 100% acrylic. Did I even tell you what this was made of? I didn't. I didn't even tell you. Oh, 100% acrylic. Maybe I did. Anyways, so this is even softer than that, actually. This is not, this is a really nice yarn. Like I said, I've had it before, and, then, and I've always thought it was a nice soft yarn. Here's how it's spun up, kind of like twisted format. A little bit it's it's plied but it's but it's got like a black uh strand through it that makes it look twisted so it's pretty cool let me look at it it's two oh, okay 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 it's two roving strands twisted together that's what it is Ooh, i like it even better now that's nice that's nice i never noticed that before anyways these are 8.99 a piece 8.99 it's probably a little high but 
I paid it. I'll continue to pay it if I buy it again. Uh, the color that I have in my hand is called Jazzy Blues. Jazzy Blues. I got three of those in the Jazzy Blues. Pretty though. Should be Jazzy Purple. More purple than blue. And then, of course, I love brown. I got it in three of them in this brown here. It's very pretty. This should not feel quite as soft as this one. Sometimes the dyes make them different, but it's still soft. Um, that's pretty, isn't it? Oranges, browns, blues. Uh, the color of this one is called Chocolate Mint. I like it. Very pretty. Yeah, I don't know why this, yeah, like I said, sometimes the dyes make them a little stiffer, but this one definitely feels softer than this one, but they're still both very soft. I like them both, but, okay, um, I did get 20% off my order also. Now, I have a mystery box left. Let's see what's in it. Sometimes their mystery boxes are pretty good, and sometimes they're just okay. I've bought them many a times. They are $29.99, and I, from my experience, they usually average between um, 15 to 20 balls of yarn in them. From as many times as I bought them, I don't think I've got any less or any more than between 15 and 20. And believe me, I bought them a bunch. I haven't bought one in quite some time, actually. This is the first one I bought in months and months, so... Um, yeah, let's see what's in this bad boy. Ew, I see scrubby yarn. I hate scrubby yarn. It's my least favorite yarn. And blanket yarn. Alright, so let's open it up. Well, here it is. So I got two, my mystery box. Two Mary Maxim, Maxim, Maxim Scrub It with Fringe. It's even worse with Fringe. Okay, I'm not a big fan of that. But anyways, I got two of those. Only because Scrubby is my, my least favorite yarn. So two of those. And then I got... Some stuff, other stuff here. I got three Premier Aurora yarns. Um, which I've had before. It's a uh, roving style uh four weight yarn from premier 166 um yards of ac acrylic so three of those uh, it's just black colored black and grays neutrals i like neutral colors and then i got some of this bernat satin which i think is really going out of being discontinued that's probably why i wound up in a mystery box but bernat satin is a nice soft yarn it's pretty purple see the purple in the couple different colors are purple in it um but it says it's a medium for yeah i say it's a medium for kind of reminds me caron simply soft but no shine on it that's kind of what bernat satin reminds me of uh, i've always thought that Anyways, uh, machine washable, dryable, 100% acrylic, 200 yards per ball. So I have got, they gave me four of those, all the same color in my mystery box. It's soft yarn. Like I said, it reminds me, I, 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 if you bought Caron Simply Soft and you took away the shine, it would be brunette satin. I know it kind of looks shiny maybe on my camera, but it's not really shiny. It's like, maybe it maybe like a tea tad but not really um like Caron simply soft so i got four of those in my mystery box then i got some premier toy box yarn i'm not a huge fan of this one but from premier um it's 100 percent acrylic bulky five it's actually quite a thick bul bulky five 109 yards, 100, yeah, I already said that, 100% acrylic. Um, I never was a huge fan of it, but since it's pink, I think Evelyn would probably like a hat and scarf out of it. Probably just a hat since it's 109 yards. Couldn't make it much more. Maybe a little ascot or something or whatever they call those things. Keyhole scarves. Anyways, I got two pinks. She'll 
I don't know. I'll put in a giveaway or she'll want something out of it. And then, again, I got some yarn that I'm not a real big fan of. This is the Premier Parfait. It's super soft. It's like uh, Bernat Velvet, kind of similar. Uh, it's their Parfait yarn. You know, it's a, it's a, it's a polyester yarn. Um, it is a bulky five, 100% uh, polyester, 156 yards. I, you know, I like uh, Bernat Velvet. I was just never a big fan of the of the Premier Parfait for some reason. I don't know. I, I mean, I like one, but not the other. They're different, but yet similar. And this one, just, I mean, I, it's okay. I just not, it's not something I go and buy um, on a regular, unless it's like super cheap. Anyways, I got two of those. And then I got some yarn that I've never s seen before. Uh, yeah, I have, but not, I've seen it, but labeled it <laughs> as a different um, company's yarn. Okay, so, uh, I can't pronounce that, so I won't even try. I've never seen this before. But, it is 100% acrylic, 280 meters, made in Turkey. So, it feels like it doesn't even say, you can machine wash, do not dry. Um, it doesn't say the weight. I'd say it's a three or a light four. It fills that of Red Heart Super Saver. Now I have three of those. Now I will tell you what, what this is. Um, I can almost with complete certainty tell you what it is. Um, it's labeled under a different brand. It's, um, it's very similar to Ice Yarns uh, Magic Light. They have it in that blue. And it's also very similar to uh, Hobium has a yarn exactly like that. In fact, I have it in this exact blue. I can't remember the name of it offhand, but yes. Yeah. So, so it's it's just labeled different. It could have been leftovers off their mill or something. I don't know what it is, but anyways, it's it's okay. It's not bad. It's okay. It would make a pretty cool. Uh, it looks like it's striped. Will make a striping effect. Not like, you know what it looks like. A striping ombre. Um, short striped ombre is kind of what it looks like. But I don't know. I don't know. Anyways. So in my mystery box, I got three. Oh, and they always send you in your mystery box. You get patterns for knit and crochet. I don't use patterns, so I don't have no use for them at all. But anyway. So in this mystery box, I wasn't a huge fan of this one, really. I, there was nothing in there that really tickled my fancy but I got one two three four five six six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen okay so I can officially go on record and say that is the worst mystery box that I've ever received from Mary Maxim and I'm um, I'm not trying to dog the company because I do like them a lot they have killer deals I like a, I like a lot of their house brand yarn and I've never been disappointed I mean I've there's been some mystery boxes that I liked better than others but there's always been yarns in each one that I, I liked really this one is just not doing it for me for some reason um, so it's Mary I don't know Mary Maximum, if you're watching, again, I'm sorry, sorry that I said your name wrong. This one, you need to up your game on your mystery boxes because there's another yarn company that's got some better ones. And I don't know, I'm not feeling this one now. So, <laughs> you guys probably, if I haven't mentioned it, Craver Yarns, they got some killer mystery boxes, which I have to open up on camera. I already did once, and then I got some more. I just got to find time to do it. But anyways, that, you know, that mystery box, you know, it just didn't do it for me this time. But, it's okay. I guess. The, this is probably the best out of the bunch for me is the Aurora. Um, the Premier Satin's okay. Or, not Premier, but not Satin's okay. The rest of it's yarns I probably won't ever use. So, but anyways. 
it is what it is. It's a mystery. You never know. Sometimes you get good ones, sometimes you don't. But I can I can tell you that I've never gotten a bad one ever before from Mary Max Maximum. This would be my first one that I would say that I don't care for. That's the first time I've ever said that about Mary Maximum's mystery boxes. So, but other, you know, I'll, I'll wait a month and maybe I'll try again and it'd be better next time. You just never, never know. You know, that's, that's why they're mystery boxes. But anyways, that's my Mary Maxim haul. Um, if you're watching this, you know, I, I, I think you should, and you guys got a little extra cash. It's, it's a good deal for this uh, Lion Brand uh, Touch and Mohair. $1.99 skein down from 7 It's a killer deal. So anyways, uh, everybody, thank you for watching. You know, I always appreciate you watching all my videos. And don't forget to check out all my tutorials. If you crochet, if you don't. Check out all my yarn content. I got lots of that. Reviews and whatnot. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Like button. Look on the sides of the screen. Maybe you'll see some more videos you like. And my face is up there. So if you're not subscribed, hit it. Hit my face. Go hard. And then subscribe. Subscribe. You guys take care. Have, have a good evening. Stay safe. Bye-bye, everybody.